Hello, good day, everyone. Welcome to the first for first ever blog for the differential calcul calculus. My first ever blog for differential calculus. What we are going to discuss now is the derivative. So what I am going to do is to give you examples and then we are going to solve some problems involving derivatives. So we have here the first example. What is the derivative with respect to x of x plus 1 raised to the third power minus x cubed? So you have to remember our formula for derivative y if y is equals to x raised to n, the first derivative will be equal to n times x raised to n minus 1. So this is our formula which will be which we will be utilizing in the determination of the derivative of x plus 1 cube minus x cube. So first we are going to equate y is equals to x plus 1 raised to the third power minus x raised to the third power. So using this formula for the first derivative, we can determine y prime. y prime will be equal to 3 times x plus 1 raised to the second power minus 3 times x raised to the second power. So you would notice that x plus 1 raised to the second power will result to a trinomial. So if we are going to say y prime, it can be equated to 3 multiplied by, so take note that if you have x plus 1, in the long method, you're going to multiply again x plus 1 by itself because we have a second power here. So this would give us x squared plus x and then this one will be x and this will be equal to 1. So this would give us x squared plus 2x plus 1. So if we are going to express x plus 1 squared in a trinomial, it can be rewritten as x squared plus 2x plus 1 minus 3x squared. Now you would notice that you can distribute this numerical coefficient to the three terms inside the parentheses. This numerical coefficient was taken from our formula of the differentials. So y prime is equals to n times x raised to n minus 1. So that would mean y prime is equals to, if we are going to distribute 3 to those terms inside the parentheses, we will have 3x squared plus 3 times 2 is 6, x plus 3. And then, of course, you have minus 3x squared. And you would notice that 3x squared minus 3x squared can be canceled out. That's roughly equivalent to 0. So we will have y prime is equals to 6x plus 3. And this will be our answer to the question, what is the derivative? 
the derivative is 6x plus 3. That would be all for this first vlog. Thank you for listening. Thank you for watching. You can like and subscribe my channel. See you on my second vlog and all the other vlogs thereafter. God bless everyone.